just transition from there to Ru Bawa's character. For me, it took me like, uh, you know, the first week went in a way where I was still figuring that whether my sur is correct or not. Is it is it more? Is it less? Am I doing uh, too much right now? If you talk about the budgets, also they are already covered because of the digital yeah. satellite and music rights. So and, and so is the case with the Chandu with the with the Satya Prem ki katha because of the uh, kind of work that maybe I have done before. The money portion is at least uh, safeguarded. I see it as a big Diwali uh, bonanza for the audience because there are two films which. Uh, uh, which are not i think perhaps it's it's the same date but it's not exactly the same genre it's it's a both of them are massive film but in their own respective world and uh, i think if two comedies were releasing together that would have been really difficult ah chillai hai tere pe mat baat mat karna hi doctor hi hello welcome to masala chat this is our first time with you on masala You you've been our cover star a few months ago, but yeah, first time with us. Thank you. Pleasure speaking to you, Karthik. So, थोड़ा इससे शुरू करते हैं. आपका last release था Chandu Champion, right? तो उसमें the film demanded a certain nuanced, introspective performance from you, and Ru Baba demands something completely different. How do you transition between the two? How do you manage that? How do you prepare for this transition? What did you do for this? I think I was just. Uh... nothing i just went from one set to the other and uh, chandu champion because i was in it for like almost 2 years and i was uh, it was more like an internal internal exactly. uh, thing over there uh, to just transition from there to ru baba's character for me it took me like uh, you know the first week went in a way where i was still figuring that whether my sur is correct or not is it is it more is it less am i doing uh, too much right now no. and uh, and anisha really helped me out with that and i think we we really again uh, we went back to where we were in bulbla 2 and we started uh, you know doing those uh, uh, kind of reading sessions where but it really changed everything again and i went to that sora again because i was feeling for the first time when i was uh, you know doing a scene um on the bulbule set it was it was just something where i felt ki main thoda zyada zyada to nahi kar raha nahi thoda oh, sorry first aisa tha ki thoda kam to nahi kar raha and anish sir had to tell me that are kartik thoda <laughs> aur kar aur kar and uh, that was the thing but then later on when i started doing that then when i was seeing the monitor then i was like ki ye zyada to nahi ho gaya so you know wo ek balance dhoond rahe the hum and uh, तो थोड़ा सा वक्त लगा उसको वापस से बैलेंस बट देन आई आई वाज वाज देयर देयर बट स्टिल यू मेक इट इट वेरी इजी इजी इज टू 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 स्लिप इन आई मीन इट्स वन थिंग गो फ्रॉम कैरेक्टर कैरेक्टर बट फ्रॉम स्टाइल टू स्टाइल इज इट एज इजी टू मूव फ्रॉम दैट इट्स नॉट सो इजी ऑल्सो बट वंस यू once so i have explored that character before yeah so i think it was uh, so that that was it it was easier for me to again get back to it uh maybe somewhere down the line it would have been really difficult uh, if i would not have i wouldn't have played this character before so i think it helped me a lot because of part 2 you mentioned you've done this before obviously so now whenever there is a sequel or a new installment in a franchise so obviously the expect especially if the last one has been successful like bulbula 2 was the expectation is that it's going to be much larger the scale is going to be larger the budget is larger the cast is much larger but you can't do much more you, you can't act more so how do you manage that while keeping your performance similar or capturing the same essence of what you did in the last film I think the story is new, the the screenplay is new, and and there are so many uh, new additions also, characters also. So you don't have to uh, really think about uh, to do uh, like you know, okay, I have to do so much or I have to do this, I have to do that. I think I, I think I was just there uh, doing my part and trying to do give two hundred percent to that, and uh, and it worked out pretty well because I. Uh, um, after all at the end of the day people they see the story they see the characters how they are in that situation the situations over here are different uh, from yeah. part 2 which makes it unique makes it different and makes it a new experience altogether for the uh, theater going audience now along with other things the one primal thing is the budget being bigger if that is 
something regularly happens now that obviously would mean the pressure is much bigger so like it or not that's something every leading actor or actress has to deal with now again chandu champion was accepted on a very very wide level but perhaps not quite hit the commercial gold mine so coming from that to this film what space are you in in terms of what expectations we have from this film i think uh, with bulbulia the uh, the basic thing is that because it was such a huge success last time uh, it's already matlab i sh- if i don't know if i should be talking about it but it's it's already something which if you talk about the budgets also they are already covered because of the digital yeah, yeah. satellite and music yeah. rights so and and so so and and so is the case with the chandu with the with the satyaprem ki katha because of the uh, kind of work that maybe i have done before and uh, and that demands a, a certain and that gets a certain um rights value uh, in terms of for the producers at least so so the the money portion is at least uh, safeguarded in that zone but uh, having said that you always want more and more uh, theatrical business you want that for uh, a certain kind of perception sometimes uh, and and maybe uh, with uh, with of course with the digitalization with the ott platforms coming in uh, there has been certain shift Uh, some kind of change where a lot of people are watching certain kind of films only in theaters um, so i think bhulbhulia is the correct film for the theaters and uh, and 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 it's it's something where a lot of people like to watch it with their friends and families and in groups so i think even if the budgets are uh, more than what they were during part 2 uh even the rights or the satellites or the digital they have also increased the Absolutely. demand for that film so it's proportional so it's equated there it's already done over there now whatever uh, baseline figures that we need to clear is is something which is which is just a uh, minimum margin level but uh but then for the perception thing of course if if the but at least there's no loss right now for the makers No, otherwise, if we were going to do a four hundred crore budget film or a five hundred, yeah. that would have been a loss that for a film like this. But uh, which is not the case, thankfully, for Bulbulia Three. It's still smartly made. Yeah, because ultimately, the money is already recovered. But what you get from the audience is ultimately what exactly, exactly. exactly. Because and with the film like this, the anticipation is so huge, it's yeah. so immense. that i mean you I mean, want the yeah uh, lots and lots of people to go to the theaters. That's what exactly. you want. Now. F- again ever since i mean we can talk about lagan versus gadar and lots of these uh, instances om shanti om savariya even something like a bang bang versus haider but now in this case we have a film where the two one could say one is a horror comedy and one is an action entertainer or an action drama but still largely broadly these are family dramas or family entertainers so I mean that is bound to cause some trepidation to you and the makers. Mm, I see it as a big Diwali uh, bonanza for the audience because there are two films which uh, uh, which are not. I think perhaps it's it's the same date, but it's not exactly the same genre. Yeah. It's it's a both of them are massy films, but in their own respective worlds. and uh, i think if two comedies were releasing together that would have been really difficult uh, but but here we have an action film we have a different genre of film and we have a horror comedy genre of film which uh, i feel people would go and watch both the films in my point of view because it's it's like uh, you can sense it that they are attracted uh, once for personally if i talk about bulbulia 3 uh, i've seen the reaction and i'm gauging the reaction and i feel a lot of people will go and watch this also so it's it's going to be a uh, now i don't know i can't predict anything mm-hmm. but i hope that people go and watch our film also of course now coming to the film itself mm-hmm. roo baba from 2 to 3 mm-hmm. how can you see the evolution of the character because now again it's not just him but there are some really tantalizing new additions with Madhuri ji with Vidya coming back in yeah. the franchise I think uh It, it it'll be exciting once you see it i i don't know how to elaborate on it uh, in terms of because i I'll, i'll spill a lot of things but there are you mind that no but <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, but i think there are a lot lots and lots of things which are happening uh, within this world and uh, 
and which are really new and unique to this world so the evolution you'll you'll get to see me in the same avatar uh, with uh, reprising the role of ru baba but uh, the the character will have uh, a lot more to do as well now apart from vidyavan return eh, there are the two new additions one is a bona fide legend in malu dikshit and one is someone who's going to coming who's starting her journey towards something a legacy like that So, how was your experience working with the two of them, with Tripti and with Madhuri Ji? With Tripti and Madhuri Ji. Yeah. Uh, 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 um, I enjoyed working with all of them actually. With uh, with Tripti also, I had great fun on sets. Uh, we were again uh, really enjoying all the scenes that were we were doing because they were either funny or romantic. So again, uh, it's it's a film which everybody enjoys uh, being a part of. uh same goes with vidya ma'am especially of i really course. i loved uh, working on uh, whenever she was on sets i really enjoyed myself with madhuri ji also i learned so much for, from her um and i've been a fan of her so it's it's been a different uh, set uh, experience for me altogether well judging the trailer by the anticipation by the buzz i think we can all All say in anime screen, no one is. Uh, we can't wait any longer. So looking forward to the film, Karthik, and many glad and wish you the best of luck for the film. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Manju, I'm coming for you.